Blue 24, Blue 24, say hi. You know, the Patriots believe in volunteering. And recently, they were right here at the Boys and Girls Club to teach the kids the importance of volunteering and how it could positively affect your life. Excitement at the Boys and Girls Club. Kids jumping around, doing exercises. You want to know why? Ho, ho, ho! I'll tell you why. The New England Patriots are in town. Actually cut the strings right then and there. And um, sometimes you have to do that. You have to realize when somebody's just getting you in trouble in life and you want to be a better person, you got to cut the strings. So I cut the strings with them. Um, you know, we, we, we weren't friends um, from third grade on. Met better people that helped me succeed where I am today. And, uh, the cone drill I had going in and out was kind of like doing karaoke through the cones. I mean, some of the kids did it well and some were falling all over the place, so it was pretty fun. That was an incredible day. You know, we were very excited that the Patriots players were able to come out, uh, talk about community service to our kids, talk about volunteerism and its importance. Mm -hmm. It was great that uh, we had an opportunity to recognize Eric Correa as, along with our, all of our other volunteers. Without volunteers uh, at this club, uh, we wouldn't be able to operate. It's that simple. And uh, we're promoting a big community service initiative um, in October. We're rolling that out. And this was a great way to kick it off. Our kids had a blast. Our staff had a great time. And uh, we think the Patriot players really enjoyed themselves. Coming out to the Boys and Girls Club, um, helping kids be active in the community, uh, playing some games with them, scavenger hunts and all. It's just a fun time to come out here and uh, make a difference. Well, it's, you know, the Patriots, uh, actually Rick Metters from the Massachusetts Alliance of Boys and Girls Clubs recommended our club. We had nominated Eric Career as, as our youth volunteer, uh, actually as a volunteer representative for the entire organization. Uh, the Patriots, this caught the Patriots' attention and, and Rick Metters vouched for our, our organization to become uh, the host site. And to have the Patriots players come out, it, it just it, it has a lot of impact. You know, we can come and we can promote volunteerism and tell the kids it's very important to volunteer and it's very important to serve your community. Uh, the Patriots players came in and, and shared their stories, which was, it, the kids, it really resonates with the kids. And they, they heard that, uh, that these players grew up just like they did and they had some of the struggles that they did. And we hope that it reaches several of our kids. Uh, we hope it reaches all of them, but even if it just, it's just a handful, uh, that's, that's the way you can really change a community or enhance a great community, and Brockton is a great place to live. Uh, we want our kids to understand that it is great. We want them to learn more about it, and we want them to give back and uh, take ownership of this city. And uh, we're getting there, but the work, uh, there's a lot of work that needs to be done. How do you top that? I mean, the Boys and Girls Club is a great thing, so anything you can do to help, you know, volunteerism of the month and whatnot, it's a good cause. Uh, not much is better than that. We, like I said, a lot of the times, rocking kids don't experience things like this. So it's good that they experience things like this, the Patriots, then not. Come on, this is going to be the greatest thing that happened to them until the day. Um, they did different activities as far as involving Triple Play, which is a program through the Boys and Girls Club to make sure that they're doing anything involving health, good eating habits, and making sure that they're staying active at all times and engaging in the activities. Crazy kids after school. I mean, uh, we're just here to celebrate volunteerism, and uh, you know, the real volunteers are in there who helps we help out at the Brockton Boys and Girls Club. I've been here seven years, almost seven years, and every employee that we've had in here, anybody, everybody that I've worked with, uh, they, they dedicate countless hours uh, during the course of uh, a week. Uh, they take time out of their day. They, they go above and beyond. Uh, they're asked to volunteer. A lot of times for the club, they step up and do it. Um, you know, they, they're, they're asked to do a lot of things. They, they do work at home. You know, we have a lot of uh, staff that dedicate some time to prep and to make sure that the program that they're running uh, is effective. And they'll take work home with them. And, you know, we don't encourage them to do that. And I can't, I can't dissuade them. <laughs> they'll do it anyway. They're just a great group of people. Uh, the staff that we have now is incredible. Uh, they're very dedicated to the mission of the organization. They're dedicated to the, the kids. And they're dedicated to the community. And uh, the organization is very, very lucky to have them here.